Hi everyone, in this video we will create a class diagram for college management system. So let's get started. The first class with us would be the uh, college management system. College MS. Uh, the second the second class is the hostel with us first I will drag the classes ok all classes then I will assign attributes and function to them and also we have a class for classroom and we have another class for department and another class would be per uh, student This is for student with us. And another class would be or with us. Let's copy this. That would be editorium. Editorium and also we have classes for um, uh, postgraduate and undergraduate. Postgraduate and undergraduate. graduate and we have stuff and we have a library class And for the stuff we have two more classes and those would be non teaching stuff and teaching stuff. And we have the counting and also we have parking. These are the classes with us in college management system. So now let's create relationship between these. Uh, let's add the attributes and functions to them. Okay. So it will take time. I will just write attribute and function for them. Then I will explain you. Uh, later we will create. Finally, at the final stage, we will create relationship for these classes. So let's do it. So I have added the attributes and the functions to all classes. So let's check them one by one. The college management system name city and contact number these are the attributes in the function open and college detail 
and for the hostel student id block number and room number and the hostel detail check in and check out and the classroom class id section department id and the classroom detail is occupied or not for the department department id name um, hod head of department and total staff and total students and the department detail and show events and also for the students these are the students these are the functions for students uh, auditorium for the auditorium's attributes and the methods and then we have these for the student we have postgraduate and undergraduate students and then we have the staff these are the attributes and the, the function and these are the classes of staffs which will inherit from staff teaching staff and non-teaching staff and let's come to the library okay these are the attributes and these are the function for the library the canteen and for the parking and for the auditorium okay so these are the classes uh, the attributes and the functions for them the methods for them so now we will create a relationship between all of these classes so let's uh, i will create it then i will explain it to you okay So the relationships has created for our classes. The first cl uh, relationship between college and hostel is uh, aggregation, okay? And the college and the uh, parking has the aggregation uh, relationship, okay? With parking. And the class has the composition relationship with department, classroom, and auditorium. Uh, then the student has the as a unidirectional relationship with classroom, with auditorium, with library. And these two postgraduate and undergraduate are inherited from student staff. Teaching and non-teaching staff are inherited from staff class and it, uh, teaching staff has unidirectional uh, with the library. Also the student has a relationship with canteen and canteen is also part of the college. college and also we can add here two other classes girls and boys hostel okay so let's add girls and boys hostel classes girls hostel and boys hostel It are inherited from hostel class yeah so it was all about college management system all classes of college management system relationships attributes and uh, methods uh, I hope this video was helpful for you. If you like this video, so please subscribe our YouTube channel. And uh, thanks for watching.